Day two of Dig Stock 5 started digging in a field where an old home site was, among the peanuts. Good morning, it's day two of digging. It's a little windy out here, uh, but it's mostly sunny, some clouds. Um, I'm in a field with an old home site, and I was just on my way back to the car, and I got a 80 signal, so let's see what it is. On. Oops. Well. Oh. It's Penny. I think it's Penny. Yep, there's Abe. Oh, and I drop it. And it's a memorial. Let's see if I can see a year. upside down. I can't see the year. Hold on. So it looks like it's a 1963 memorial. Yay! I just wasn't feeling the fields this morning so I hopped around a couple more times. And I dug lots and lots of can slaw and bits of iron that I dumped in the buckets that were near every field where you could park. I also checked out those buckets and found some interesting bits of iron and a guy I talked to said he even found a merc someone had dropped in. It's turned out to be a beautiful day. I'm in my third field this morning because I just am not feeling stuff. Only found that 1963 penny. But it's pretty out here, it's windy. So I have my hood up to protect my neck and my ears. here just some can slaw and a lot of holes that aren't filled in guys fill in your holes I don't understand that I've also gone behind people who've left trash sticking out of the holes they've dug take your trash fill in your holes I think I need to make a quilt like that so I'm in a new field there's a row of houses along here. I just dug a kind of crazy signal and had some high 80s. And it was somebody else's hole. And look what I dug. A large flat button. It's it doesn't have much shank left. I can't, it's got something on it, but I can't tell what. Awesome! I finally found something this morning other than a 1963 penny. Y'all, can you see that? It looks like crossed cannons. I don't know what this is, but it's so cool. Yay! On my way out of the field, I asked some nice guys to help me identify it. They thought it was World War One, and when I looked it up, I found out it was a World War I um, enlisted artillery collared disc. It was awesome. So this has been like the best spot. I found a button with cross cannons on it. I found a nice flat nail all in one hole. And I found this which rings up as silver and it's not like aluminum. So it might actually be a piece of silver. Oh my goodness. And better yet, somebody else had already dug this hole. And look how gorgeous it is out here, other than the wind is cold. So having a good time. And by the way, I'm trying to make it to the bathrooms, but I keep finding stuff. Super cool. I was also finding bits of pottery, and it was nothing exciting, but it gave evidence to the people who had once lived here. Just when I thought... I was done with this hole. I found another, there was another signal. It looks like a snap. Interesting. Okay, I'm still sitting here beside the same hole. So what have I gotten? Four things out of this hole now? 
I just got this silver thing. It's got lines and a number on it with a triangle. Not quite sure what it is. I'll have to clean it up and investigate further. But oh my gosh, I can't get away from this pole. It's full of unusual signals, but every signal has turned into something interesting. I gotta keep digging. Lots of cool finds coming out of the fields. There are so many fields, so many cool finds. Coins of all kinds. Coins, buttons, and I'm going to add my new thing next to my other thing. Hey Mason, the collar you want to pick up button. Mason wants to pick up In, uh, infantry, possibly civil Mason war. That's a cool finds. I'm back in field one where I found the two uh, flat buttons, the gilded, and I have arrowhead, and everybody's out here digging for pottery. I came out here to dig for pottery too, so I'm going to check out what they're doing. That'll detect on the way because you never know what you might find. Digging up pottery pieces, which I just did with those guys over there. They let me shake the screen and I got some pottery pieces. 1500 year old Woodlands Indians right, to go with my arrowhead from the same field, field number one. So, end of day two, and it is the end, uh, found that uh, disc, artillery, infantry, artillery, collar disc from World War I with the cross cannons this morning. That was my find. I found a few other little things. And then this afternoon, didn't really find anything except I went back to field one and I, uh, they were digging. I have some video you probably saw, uh, using these big screens to look for the pottery. Uh, and I did get some pieces of pottery, so yay, and a couple cool rocks. Great day. Looking forward to day three of digging tomorrow and prizes. Woo -woo. You can probably tell I was wind blown and dead tired. I went back to my hotel room and planned and went to bed. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe and come back to watch part three. And you can follow me at Lucky Duck Digger on Instagram.